Hi everyone. I thought you might enjoy a shot of my ever-growing library. But I want to share a few lines out of this book, The Saturnalia by Macrobius, written in about 430 AD. The book is about a group of men who gather during the holiday of the Saturnalia to discuss the origins. And they note that Saturnalia is older than the city of Rome and that the custom began in Greece. And one of them says, telling the secret account that flows from the pure source of truth is forbidden, even in the very midst of the rites. And if someone learns them, he is commanded to keep them hidden within his heart. That we will not do. Can you even imagine that group of men that seized a high hill and called themselves Saturnians? Back to this divine council we've been looking at. This great assembly of planet gods. from the time when heaven flowed down from heaven. And it is within this cosmic mountain that the tree of life emerges. And also the squatter man flanked by the two. So we're going to look again at the identifying markers. Being flanked by the two or holding the two. And treading on the beast. This is literally a squatting man under the assembly of the gods. We have to reconsider the true identity of these gods. Holding the two and treading on the beast. under the divine council. In the past, I have said that Nergal is Mars because that is what mainstream tells us. But this is Nergal holding the two under the assembly and treading on the beast. Nergal is also known as Era. And when we read the epic of Era, he says, I left my dwelling and caused the deluge. The positions of the heavenly bodies changed and I did not restore them. It's the origins of the opening of Pandora's box. We have to reconsider the true identity of the original Ares, AKA Mars.
That bird at the top of the head is a symbol of the winged disc of the assembly of the gods. Here we see Poseidon flanked by the two and treading on the beast. to stop putting so much faith in these Greek and Roman orators who are continually trying to one-up each other by taking the names of regional gods and goddesses and creating these elaborate genealogies and family trees that have no basis in reality. Looks to me like these planets were given these names after the breakup of the assembly of the planet gods. They were given the names of former names of the Squatter Man event.
I am Father Saturn of all the younger gods. I am indeed Osiris Rex. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good night.